good afternoon guys and what's on the table today what we have on the table today guys are iconic are spectacular in my opinion what we have today is a major pickup this is my favorite these are my favorites. Now, let me say this first. I did not locate or find these myself. I did not. I had help finding these shoes. And it, what, what, was, what was so crazy is like, she helped me find these and now she's like the shoe guru connoisseur researcher like she has found all the Jordan that I was looking for and to add to the shoe collection she located them don't know how but thank you so much now this is the best Jordan ever in my opinion this Jordan 6 is the bomb Okay, the first time I seen a Jordan 6, my older brother had a pair of Jordan 6s, the black and red ones, which will always be my favorite, but I like the Jordan 6, but the black and red are nice. I think I seen them in, I think he had them in 90 or 91. I think they came out in 91 because I believe they were debuted in the All-Star game that year. And that's, this is actually the shoe that Michael Jordan won his first championship in, is the Jordan 6. All right, guys, let's get to it and crack this box open. Oh, I see. They got the, the splatter paint paper in this one. Let's guys check out the other one. The other one's in there sleeping. Nice box. What I like about the box, we got the splatter. Uh, sorry guys, they've got the splatter, red and white on the box. And it has the splatter, red and white on the shoe. This is my favorite. The Jordan 6 is my favorite, like I said before. Like I said, when I first seen them, I fell in love with them. I fell in love with those black and red suede shoe. This one is all leather. Uh, two iconic things that I like about this Jordan 6 is the tongue in it. I'll show you the, the next one because I have not taken these apart, loosened them up or anything. I'll show you on the, the second set that I have these Jordan I just love the I call them earmuffs or some people call them wings right here the style design this is this is great I love that piece right here if you guys can see it good style design I like the perforated holes in it I like the way they reflect they have like a, a reflection in them through the perforated holes this little piece has always been like iconic to this shoe. I always love the bottom. Got the like the jelly, jelly bottom. Um, this is probably one of the when air bubbles like first came on the scene. This is like one of the like original air bubble shoe also like they had the air max i think the air max was made in 79 but the but the air bubble i have to check that i think this is probably one of the first joints with an air bubble let me see if i could check that out real quick for you guys and there's one thing about this shoe i wish they would have changed and uh, i'm going to show you guys real quick
computer one. I, I believe this one. I might be wrong. No. The fours. I think the fours had. Yeah. I think the fours had an air bubble. Yeah, 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 yeah. I believe the fours had an air bubble. Um, first. Get to it and check it out guys and like i said one thing i wish they would have changed on this shoe like they have the red jordan sign here i wish they would have put the red and jordan sign back here and even on the, the original black and red ones the the jordan sign was black also so on this one that was just the original design that they did but i would have liked to see the the red back there and they would have made the jordan right here in red i wish they would have did that now let's check it out to see that's probably the second pair i'm not 100 percent sure but yeah the fours the fours have the air bubble in them so my let's see if i can Have them? I think the threes. Yeah, I think the threes and fours had the air bubble. Let me see. Yeah, the three or four had the air bubble. So this was the third. Okay. The threes and fours had the air bubbles, and this was the third shoe in the Jordan to have the air bubble. So three fours and the sixes had the air bubbles. And I'll tell you, I love the air bubbles in them. So like I said, the Jordan 6 is my favorite shoe, guys. So you guys wanna drop those, you know, those gifts off, just drop me a, a Jordan uh, 6, size 14. Thanks, guys. All right. I'm just going back over the list to see. Yeah. Man, iconic. Third shoe. I like the threes and I like the fours. I like the three cements. I like the fours in the black, gray, white. I like them in. Oh, hold on. Let me see. I'm trying to see if the Jordan 5. I don't think the Jordan 5 had them. I don't think Jordan. I don't think the 5 had an air bubble. Let me see. I don't believe it. That's another one I like also. No. The five had them also. Let me see if the five original had them. I believe the five had them also. So yeah, guys. So um, so three, four, and five. Three, four, and five had the air bubble at the bottom. Three, four, five, and the six had the air bubbles. I love their bubble. In them, but yeah, I had went back and checked, and the five has them also. Just a quick pickup um, for you guys to check out, to add to the shoe collection. And I have one more that I want to show you guys. So like I said, probably five, six, seven times before, the Jordan 6 are my favorite. Okay, now this one, the next one up is another Jordan 6. Man, I'm, I'm glad I was able to get, uh, get uh, me a pair also. paper in the box fresh all right guys this is another major pickup this is the size of the box I love the graphics on this box I'm 
want you guys to check it out. The graphics on this box are amazing. I don't know if I said it before, but the Jordan Sixes was the ones he had his first championship in. Let me show you the side. I believe they were debuted, like I said, in the All-Star game that year. It's just black on the back of the box. This is a Jordan 6. Ooh -wee. Let's see which one is this. Oh yeah, Jordan 6, retro drop with the Georgetown piece, oh yeah, these are all suede like the originals, alright, let me give you the one that's in there sleeping, there's one in there sleeping, that one's in there napping, alright, let's take a walk around this Jordan 6, my fave, Okay, this Jordan 6, man, I'm telling you, it's wonderful. Like I said about the red and white ones. Like I said, iconic piece. Like I said, these had been loosened up, so I can show you guys the, the detail. I always like these. Can't never lose these guys. I always have to keep them. Yeah, I'm telling you, I love this tone. I wish I could find out what what uh, made them design this this tone. I don't know. Looks like uh, Mars Blackman glasses. I don't know. Just a just a thought. But I love this tone. This tongue is really nice. I like this piece. How they added the the blue accent to it. Sorry, guys. Hopefully you guys can see. And then in this one, like I said, the front Jordan matches the back Jordan. I like that they add this to this Georgetown one. And this one is the suede. Like the black original ones. I like the suede in them. Um, when I originally got the sixes, um, the easy way to clean them back in the day was foam glass cleaner my pops always used foam glass cleaner and uh he always been big on clean shoes so i always use foam glass cleaner i've probably been using foam glass cleaner for 30 years now you know i had the black ones and then i just hit them with the foam cleaner come back with a towel they look back brand new. So if you guys got those black ones and uh, want them to make a, want them to look great, grab a can of foam glass cleaner, and I'm telling you, they'll look back brand new, even when you clean them. Like I said, uh, I use foam glass cleaner for everything. Two strings back, but like I said, I like the Jordan, the Jordan sixes are my favorite, and uh, I can show you uh, the glass cleaner that I use for everything. Be right back. All right, guys, I am back. And I want to show you guys this glass cleaner is the best. Now, it's, I, I have never even really looked at the can. I just, you know, spray away. Hey, let me grab 
Let me grab me a couple of things of that. This Brayway glass cleaner says the world's best already. Wow, I didn't even know that. This, I use this to clean everything. This cleaner is great. So like I said, with a black suede or black leather, you want to just wipe your shoe off, keep it clean. Sprayway foaming glass cleaner is the best. Uh, places I pick them up at, um, sometimes I catch them on sale at O'Reilly's. I try to check the sale at O'Reilly's. Or if you want to grab them, like I grab them, like 10 of them or 8 of them, and uh, hit Sam's Club's up. Get Grab Sam's Club. And you get eight to ten 19 ounce cans which is a deal um, sometimes I try to check Walmart for it but Walmart's usually empty because a lot of body shop guys actually use this also while doing body work yep, but I use it for anything mirrors in the house and anything to be clean it's, it's, it's a great cleaner all right, guys. That's a quick episode of What's on the Table today, guys. Thank you guys for tuning in. Thank you guys for helping the channel grow and all the comments that I get and all the people that I help with other things that I do on the channel. But these are two two major pickups that I picked up. Was this Jordan 6 and the Georgetown and this Jordan 6 in the red and white all right guys that's another episode of what's on the table today you guys be great be fabulous and I'm out